If you thought season one was wild, season two is going to be one trip you will never forget. Check out the trailer for the new season of The Flight Attendant coming soon to HBO Max. My life and everything, it just all feels pretty great. Since I quit drinking, I've been making changes. You have throw pillows? It's like somebody lives here. You're an important part of my life. You know, maybe we should move in together. Hello, gorgeous. Hello, beauty. You seem very put together. Do I? We should hang out in Berlin. I actually have to work when I get there. You have work in Germany? It literally feels like you're living in a spy novel. What's going on, Cass? I'm an asset for the CIA. <laughs> I know, we said no more secrets, but you were just about to guess it anyway. What does it matter? Cassie, I was like literally nowhere close to figuring that out. My family always said I was the bad job. There are a lot of weird things going on around me. I'm starting to think that someone is pretending to be me. It sounds like someone's trying to frame you. I have worked so hard to build this new life, and I am holding on to it with everything that I have. Are you? Are you me? Oh, God, don't answer that. But you think you're going to find some hot dead guy in here again? <laughs> what the? Like I always do the wrong who the hell is that? That is a black hole of joy. Uh, who are you? I'm you, silly. If you made better choices. Yes, I'm always going to be the bad child. Do you know how badly I want to drink? You do the same. Yeah. You're jump seating a flight to Iceland under a false identity. I'm starting to worry about your impulsive behavior. Megan? The North Koreans. I have a bounty on my head. Who would have thought? Me. A prize. I think it's all gonna be mm. maybe fine. Mm -hmm. I need that evidence before someone murders me. Hey, Mom. Guess I'm always gonna be the best child. I guess I'm I'm one tiny accent away from a complete collapse. You keep telling everyone that life is just so great. Just not buying it. My family always said I was the bad child.